Hi there, my name is John Mavey. Welcome to another segment of Hippo Shorts. In this segment, we're going to talk about specific treatments directed at patients that are symptomatic and have EKG changes due to hyperkalemia. There are three prongs to this approach. The first one is stabilizing the cardiac membranes. The second is trying to shift potassium back into cells. And lastly, we want to try to eliminate potassium from the body. How do we stabilize the cardiac membranes? That's done by administering one gram of calcium gluconate that's delivered IV. That's the same as giving 10 cc's of a 10% solution. How do we shift potassium into cells? The common way we do that is by administering 10 units of regular insulin that's given as an IV bolus along with 50 cc's of D50 that's administered over a five minute period. Lastly, how do we eliminate potassium from the body? In patients with renal function, you can give that person furosemide as an IV dose of 40 milligrams. Alternatively, we can use pteromir that's given as an 8.4 milligram dose per day. Lastly, in patients that are refractive to treatment or if they have um, uh, poor renal function, that person is probably a candidate for hemodialysis. So that wraps it up for Hippo Shorts for today. If you want more information, please feel free to go to hippoeducation.com. We'll see you next time.